Good morning, guys. Welcome back to Crypto Future. Uh, we're going to talk a little XRP this morning. Good morning to you guys. Good morning to you guys. Uh, right now, we're looking at on the day, we're up 1.7% uh, to four. 48 cents and we're up four percent on the week um, so a couple of stories to go over real quick here uh, first one uh, ripple confirms uh, Brad Garlinghouse confirms uh, on the Nasdaq ripple about to I IPO now we've known that ripples gonna IPO for a while now um, they've said it multiple times but the fact that uh, the Nasdaq is now responding to their purchases and things of that nature could it be a sign that uh, the case is coming to an end and that Ripple is preparing everything for the IPO because we know they're going to as soon as the case is over. So very, very bullish news, guys, very bullish news. <clears throat> and in another story here, we've got uh, John Deaton says that, uh, in his opinion, FOMO is not going to kick in on XRP until it breaches that $2 mark. Now, i got to agree with him here. I think that uh, a lot of the retail is going to start buying in after it gets to $2. We all know how it works, right, guys? FOMO kicks in, and then all of a sudden everybody's buying. We'll probably get to four or five bucks. People will start taking profits around there. We'll have a pullback. My guess is pull back down to about two dollars, two thirty, something like that. Um, but that's uh, that's the short-term uh, view, uh, and I got to agree with Deaton on that one. FOMO kicks in after we breach two dollars, and a um, little bit of uh, chart analysis here by Egrad Crypto. Uh, so, Deaton's latest remarks express the attorney's shock that uh, that some investors have failed to leverage the opportunity to purchase XRP at a discounted price below a dollar, which I totally agree with. This syncs with the statement shared by several pro prominent analysts who have forecasted massive gains for the asset XRP in the foreseeable future. Um, so, the... Re uh, let, let's get down to uh, eGrad there. Check them out on YouTube or on uh, Twitter as well. Um, doo -doo -doo. Uh, in a more recent analysis, the market watcher eGrad Crypto uh, pointed out that XRP is currently in a crucial position, uh, and and its price movement from here could take it to three dollars and thirty cents, or propel a surge to two hundred and fifty dollars. That's insane, guys. Like. What are you gonna? The only question I have for you when XRP goes to two hundred fifty dollars is, uh, how many boats are you buying? How many planes are you buying? How how many uh, how many cars are you buying? Right. Um, responding to Deaton's comments, another analyst, JD, noted that XRP is currently stuck within a bullish symmetrical triangle. JD asserted that XRP would likely break out. Of the triangle by September, he forecasts a massive rally for the asset once it breaks out, but chooses not to make any projected price targets. Uh, meanwhile, XRP is currently trading for 47 cents. It's 48 cents as of, as of the making of this video. Uh, up 4.38% on the week, like we talked about. The asset has printed consecutive winning candles in the past four days, leading to a 6.29 gain within that time frame. So, 200, uh, $250 XRP? Yes, please. Uh, check out uh, eGrad on, uh, on Twitter. Like I said, I follow him. Love checking out his charts and stuff like that and his reasons why he says what he says. And uh, yeah, shoot me a like, shoot me a subscribe, uh, comment down below. Let me know what you guys think. Are we going to see a $250 XRP? Are we going to see a $3.30 XRP by September? Let me know, guys.